Hello everyone, my name is Karen and today I'm going to be teaching you how to egg beater kick. Uh, egg beater kick is used in water polo synchronized swimming and it provides stabilization for lifeguards when they are rescuing victims. Um, so first I suggest that you try this outside of the water just so that you can really see what is going on with your feet and until it feels natural. Then you can move on and impress all of your friends at the next pool party. I recommend using a high chair so that your feet won't touch the ground. You can have the most freedom possible. And this is literally the position that you're going to be in in the water. Your legs do need to be at almost a 90 degree angle. And uh, let's start off. So your right leg is going to be moving counterclockwise, so inward. And then your left leg is going to be moving clockwise. Again, inward. So let's try it all together. For extra stabilization, I would recommend this. Uh, this is called treading water. You put your hands in little cups and move them like this. Don't worry about your legs making perfect circles. They do not have to be perfect. They can be ovals. So now for the physics behind this. So while the swimmer is moving their feet, they are causing the water above their feet to move faster than the water that is under their feet. Bernoulli's principle states that the faster moving water has a lower pressure than the slower moving water. This difference in pressure between the moving water and the surrounding water creates a force propelling the swimmer upwards to an area of decreased pressure. So the higher you want to propel yourself, the faster you move your feet. Thank you so much for learning how to egg beater kick with me, and I hope you have a wonderful day.